And this is not a partisan issue. This is not Democrats versus Republicans. I have stayed 100 miles away from any politics all through this. This is no time for politics. And this is not a political divisive issue. Uh, this is all the governors in the United States. National Governors Association rep represents all the governors. The White House left it to the governors to do the reopening, right? All the states are doing the reopening. You can't tell the states, go reopen, figure it out, and then not provide them with the funding to do it. The head of the National Governors Association is a Republican governor, Governor Hogan. I'm the vice uh, chairman of the NGA. I'm a Democrat. In unison, in a united voice, we're saying to Washington, you need to pass funding for state and local governments. The House passed a bill that did it. Uh, that also provides funding for testing. Washington was very quick to fund businesses and corporations. The bills they passed thus far have been about funding corporations and businesses to keep, to prop up the economy. Fine. Who did they not fund? They didn't fund state governments and local governments. Who do state and local governments fund? They fund the hospitals, they fund the police, they fund the firefighters, they fund the school teachers, they fund the food banks. Why was Washington so quick to fund the corporations and the big businesses, but now they have to think about whether or not they want to fund state governments and local governments, the hospitals, the police, the firefighters, school teachers. What sense of priority do you have that you see so clearly the need for corporations, but you don't see the need to continue basic services. And what makes this uh, so offensive to me, you turn on the TV, see all these ads praising the healthcare workers and the nurses and the doctors who saved so many lives and worked so hard and the first responders who went out there. They're the heroes of today. And they are. And they are and they should be acknowledged, and they should be funded. The world is different today than it was. Uh, there's a, there are situations in life that can happen on a moment's notice and change the very trajectory and definition of your life. You can get health news uh, about an individual that just changes your whole life, what you thought was so important yesterday becomes totally unimportant. This situation, this COVID virus has changed the world fundamentally. I don't believe we ever go back to where we were. I don't even believe life is about going back, right? Life is about going forward. But this is a different world. It's a different world individually. It's a different world for families. We're all trying to recalibrate and reassess who we are and how we live and what's important, what's not important. I hope on an individual level that this period is going to make me a smarter person, a better person, a deeper person. Uh, it's made me question a lot of things about my life, a lot of priorities, a lot of things I was doing. Makes you think through personal relationships and what's important and where have you been spending your time? And was that the smartest use of time? Uh, sometimes when something is taken away, you see how valuable it was. Now you can't go see family members if you wanted to. You can't see friends if you wanted to. Uh, when someone says you can't, uh, changes your whole perspective. And you ask yourself, well, why hadn't I been? Why didn't I? Uh, and when I get a chance, how am I going to do it differently this time? And I think that can actually be a good process to go through. Painful, but good. Uh, but it's also true for government. Uh, government is important again, right? Uh, government, most days, you lead your life, government, politics, it's a sideshow. It's not that important. When does government really become important? Probably almost not in my lifetime. You know, when has it been vital? It's vital at the time of war. 
uh, crisis, real national crisis. But that's the only time it's really vital where you don't have a choice but to deal with and rely on government. Well, government is now important again. In a way, it hasn't been in my lifetime. Uh, it matters what government does. Government has made the difference between life and death here. 